round fire. That knocks us back to the 1850s. So the repertoire of tunes is frozen. And whenever you look at it, it's a snapshot of what the, what the music was back in the early 1800s in Ireland. And there really was one kind of music. And it wasn't Irish music, it was just music. You know what I mean? Because there wasn't any other kind of music. We call it Irish traditional music, they just called it music. It was what you danced to. What we play is the disco beat of the late 1700s. Right? <laughs> That's what this stuff is. And whenever they marched, they weren't marching to Irish traditional music, they were marching to pop music. They were marching to stuff they liked and they danced to every day and they thought it was good crack. And that what was going on. We think it's political. I think Catholics play this stuff. And Orange Men play this other stuff, but it's not like that. It's very complicated. And the Hibernians up the road were marching to exactly the same stuff, but they had green banners and shamrocks and the drums and pictures and pack. Our crowd had orange lilies, um, everything else was orange, and King William on the banners. But there's a mirror image effect, and they both do exactly the same things, and they hit the other crew, and they do exactly the same things at each other. Um, we think it was always two ways. It was always hundreds of ways. All the music we have in Ireland comes from lots of other places and it's mixed in with whatever was there before. Okay? So you can trace threads back to Scotland, England, Wales, the continent, America, and Gaelic Ireland. And they all get messed up in this big pot and they turn into this other stuff. And the orange music I thought was separate actually turns out to be the same thing and be different. It's another adoption and adaptation of stuff that has been adopted and adapted already. And where you are now, it might be so strange. Coming from where we were there, that's a big deal. Because the way things are in the North leads you, I do have boring spectacles or green spectacles. And life, in fact, is not like that. Life is very messy. I'm, I'm going to play two tunes now, two fife and tunes. Two of the best ones that I think. Fife and tunes have a great rhythm. It's not a swing and it's not strict military tempo. It's more of a dander, as we would say at home, right? And there's a nice. Uh, Thing to it. The first one's called Own Bottle Roar. And the second tune was Willie Nichols' favourite tune, and it's called Number Five. Willie said, The best tune they play, he says, when you were coming home that day after a big long walk, coming down the hill with a good drummer behind you and a wee bit of a wind to push you along, he says, This was a good tune to you, Willie. Anyway. <laughs> 